Hi friends, welcome back to the Programmer Guide YouTube channel. Today we are going to discuss about the write a Java program to find the average salary of each department. In the organization, there are so many departments. Is there each department is each department employee having the different set of salary? But we would like to know what is the average salary we are giving based from that department. Okay. So such kind of uh, situations we can use the Java 8 program to get the data. Okay. So now we, we have the we have created the one employee class which is having these fields employee ID name age gender department year of joining and salary. So for that we have created the one constructor and getters and two string method. Okay. So and also we have created the one factory class which is having the data okay so in this fact uh, class right we have created the one static factory method which is having the different employees and different de departments okay and different set of salaries so now if you want to practice this program right you can pause the video and enter this data into the your system and practice it to your local okay so now we will write the program how we can uh, get the average salary okay uh, we need to get that list of data right uh, list employee emp list goes to see what are, what about the class we have created right java 8 employee data dot get employee data this is the method we have created from here we can get call it actually so if all the experienced person already knows control click right it will go here for freshers and who is watching newly for this videos right you can get to know by using control and click okay control shift o can import the data okay now we need to get the each dep uh, i mean we are having the different departments right first there is a two steps are there okay grouping the grouping the data based on department okay second point is averaging the total okay we are having the set of uh, methods in uh, collections right collectors dot averaging okay averaging averaging all department salary okay now to group right gr uh, we, we need to use collectors dot grouping so the the result of that right it is going to be written the map okay map so department we are going to store as a key okay so department string averaging sal uh, salary and each department so it is going to return the double okay double average each department salary average salary each department okay now what we need to do we have a list of data so we need to convert this list into the stream okay emp list dot stream so once stream has been processed right we need to collect that stream collect of collectors dot dot grouping by the collectors dot grouping by function is there okay grouping by what we need to group we need to group it based on the employee department each department okay so employee double colon get department that's where we have written the to hold the departments right we have declared the string okay now what we need to do we need to average the data okay so after group i mean we are having the collectors dot dot averaging double okay employee salary based on salary right so we have grouped and averaging this depart each department based on the salary okay now let me import all these statements control shift 4 see um 
now we got the we have been grouping the data based on the department and uh, averaging the data based on the salary okay so now what we need to do we need to print the data so there is a two ways but we will print as a programmatically so now we need to print the data right we will use the programmatically map dot entry for map dot entry key is the same string and double key and values string and value is the double double entry colon so averaging salary in each department the map is there right dot entry set so this out of this out of uh, entry dot key entry dot get key plus entry dot get value entry dot get key and value so this is our logic how we can get see we are having two set set steps actually this is the main uh, functionality so one is the grouping the data based on the department and averaging the all department salary so once we group this right here uh, again collectors dot averaging will gives the average salary from the each department okay let me execute this program the uh, the first department is product and development okay and each department is having the average salary here okay all the employees who belongs to the um, uh, each department right that has going to be printed here so i hope you have been enjoyed watching this video if you like the content of the video please like and share the video with your friends and subscribe my channel for the future videos thank you very much for watching this video take care bye bye